Good evening, people. Good evening, people. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Okay. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Okay, I'm going to take the attendance. Alejandra Beatriz Guzman. Um, Andrea Fabiola Menjivar. Cecilia de Los Angeles, Adrián. Here, teacher. Okay. César Guadalupe Enríquez. Yet. Edgar Abel Tejada. I'm here, teacher. Okay. Elson Stanley Hernández. Present, teacher. Okay. Elvira Lorenza Álvarez. Present teacher. Okay. Liliana María Los Guerrero. I'm here. Okay. Irma Raquel García. Present teacher. Okay. Joana Yesenia García. Present teacher. Okay. José Daniel Chávez. Present teacher. Okay. Catherine Alejandra Hernandez. Present teacher. Okay. Nidia Esmeralda Marroquín. Present teacher. Okay. Rafael Alejandro Anaya. Reina Elizabeth Guerrero. Samuel Isaac Flores. Tania Pamela Montoya. Present, mister. Okay. Very good. Yeah.
Okay. I want to check this exercise quickly, but we are going to do this. I want you to write your request in the chat here in, in Zoom. Okay. Write your request, everyone, please, and I will make any correction if necessary. So let's start with number one. Write in the chat, please, your request for situation one. Lend me some money for an espresso. Okay, I'm I'm waiting. I'm reading at the chat, waiting for your sentences. Lend me some money for an espresso. Write the formal request. Okay. Very good. Come on, people, right? What do you have? Okay, very good. Only two. Okay, Nidia, very good. So you see, there are different ways to, to do it. Okay, and you, Anna, nice. Okay, now please number two, take these books back to the library for me. Write the, the formal request. Two. Okay. 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 Good. Number three, please. Okay, number three. 
Let me wear your leather jacket to the party this weekend. See? Look at the. I was wondering if you'd mind lending me your. It's a little more complicated. You let me wear. Is my landing letting me use where okay? Could you let me where? Okay, what is it, number? Number four now. I'd like to borrow your cell phone to call my friend in law. Do you mind if I use? No.
are making some corrections to your sentences. And if I borrow it. Uh, Good borrow, maybe. If I borrow that, could be. I would like to borrow your cell phone to call my friend. Um, do you mind if I borrow? Would you mind? I like to borrow. Oh, it's a lot, so give me a second. Fine. Borrow the name. <laughs> okay. Bye. Okay, so I try to make all the corrections. Number five. Can I look at the newspaper when you finish reading it? Okay, maybe you didn't you didn't finish that one, so okay, we better continue. We did four already. So you have to be careful with the how to use the structure. Try to try to use this language as is shown here. Can I borrow to you the verb, the base form, or oh, with modals like can or could? So we always use the verbs in the base form. Is it okay if I use your phone? See the verb usually is in the base form. Do you mind if I use? Would it be okay if I pick it, picked it up? Here we 
would it be okay if I it actually it depends also in the in the tense you are talking right but with mine usually we use an, a gerund would you mind letting me if you'd mind lending me yeah, with more vowels, the verb in the base form. So pay attention to those details, okay? Okay, people, we have to move on. Yesterday, I sent a video to, through WhatsApp. I don't know if you took time to, to watch it. It's about this topic, unreleased consonants. Did you watch the video? Did anyone watch the video? Nobody? Yes, I watched no, the video. I didn't, sorry. Okay. Yes, can you look for it in whatsapp and watch it please i will give you time i cannot show it here because of these videos go to youtube and sometimes they have uh, copyrights so, and, and we cannot use them in the class but i want you to watch it is not that too long because uh, that will help you to understand what is this topic of unreleased consonants. Basically, in few words, is when the, the consonant at the end of a word is not fully pronounced. Yeah, it's cut, it's reduced, it's stopped, because the next word starts with a similar sound. Right? So we don't use the full sound of the consonant at the end of one word because the next word starts with a similar sound. That is the idea. Okay. So I will give you five minutes to watch it. Look for it in WhatsApp. I already sent the the link there when you finish watching it you know, time please okay, raise your yeah. hand but watching turn off your microphones please uh, so the audio uh, shouldn't be heard in our recording i'm sorry So when you finish watching it, raise your hand.
Okay, I only see one hand up. 
but I hope you finished with the video. So as I was telling you, the unreleased consonant means that uh, you don't release the sound completely, okay? So, for example, you don't say good dog. No, right? So, in these examples, let me read the example we have here. So, we say good dog. You see, we uh, practically join the sounds, okay, into one sound. Good dog take, and here also, so we don't say good dog, good dog. No, we, we stop the sound, the fully sound of the D to connect it with the next D. We stop the full sound of the G, dog. Good dog take, take care. See here also, we don't say take care of my pet tarantula. We are combining the sounds, right? Stopping the sound of the first letter. Good dog. Here, right? Good dog, take care of my pet tarantula. See? We combine them into one sound. Can you ask Bob, can you ask Bob to sit behind Kate? Can you ask, we don't say, can you ask Bob to sit behind Kate? No. So we are reducing or unreleasing, stopping the full sound of the concert. Okay? So the idea with this exercise is to find those unreleased consonants in this sentence. We have a couple of sentences here. Um, well, we don't have the audio. Let me read them for you first. I wonder if I could borrow that book. I wonder if I could borrow that book. Yes, but can you take it back to Greg tomorrow? Yes, but can you take it back to Greg tomorrow? Would you mind giving Albert some help moving that big bed? Sorry, but my doctor said my back needs rest. Circle the unreleased consonants for you. Then I will send you to compare with a classmate or with some classmates. And later we are going to compare together, okay? I'll give you five minutes to do it individually. And then I will send you to do it in, to check your work.
When you finish, please raise your virtual hand to let me know that you're done. Okay, I will send you to work in small groups, please. Compare your work. Join the breakout room, please, and compare your work, okay?
Okay, who wants to give me the the unreleased consonants in the first sentence? I wonder if I could borrow that book. Okay, teacher, I'm not sure, but I tried to do it. Okay. I, I wonder, I underline the D. The D. And then the B and... Mm -hmm. I wonder. V and F. Wonder if I could D and V could borrow that book. Here. Mm -hmm. Was it this one? Um, this D, uh, I wouldn't take this D because this is a, this, this, this usually happens between words. Okay. Okay. Between words. I wonder, wonder, I would say the R. Wonder if, wonder if. Mm -hmm. I say wonder, wonder if. So, if I, if I, the F also. If I, the, could borrow, could borrow that book. E. Okay, who wants to try with the second? Part. Yes, but can you take it back to Greg tomorrow? Come on, people, don't be shy. But letter T. What T? The but. But, okay. Yes, but can, yeah. And, and to take, uh, take. Uh, usually goes is at the end. So if you see the examples, our letters at the end, sounds at the end of the words. Oh, take it back. Take it back. It, this one. Take it back. Back to Greg, this one also. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Next. Would you mind giving Albert some help moving that big bed? Okay, you tell me. D, would you? Yes or no? Would you? Yes, would you? Yes, okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. This D? Yes no. or no? Yes, no. Would you mind, would you mind giving, would you mind giving, you, yes. you, you heard a complete D, would you mind, no, it's top, would you mind giving, DG? Giving. Yes. Giving. Yes. Yeah, giving. giving Albert some help, this T? T, Albert. Yes, that's right. <laughs> Help moving. Help moving. Yes. Help. DG. Moving. Usually, yes. usually these letters D, D, K, D, B, and B. You see, when they are followed by other consonant sounds. Usually. Um, sorry, but see, but my doctor By said my doctor said said my said my back my back needs stretch basically. 
Okay. That's the idea with it. Okay. Now let's try to read it without releasing those consonants. Actually, I think I will delete this one. It's hard. This. Yeah. Because we were basically working with T, D, K, G, P, and B. To avoid confusion. Okay, I wonder if I could borrow that book. I wonder if I could borrow that book. Yes, but can you take it back to Greg tomorrow? Yes, but can you take it back to Greg tomorrow? Would you mind giving Albert some help moving that big bed? Uh, actually, this G. That big bag, this T, and this G. Would you mind giving Albert some help moving, help moving, moving that big bed? Sorry, but my doctor said my back needs rest. Okay. So that will help you to have a more fluent pronunciation, okay? Not to pronounce the consonants with her, their fully potential at the end of the words when the next sound is another consonant sound. Okay? Any question with this? At the moment, no, teacher. At the moment. Okay. I'm okay, teacher. Thank you for asking. Okay. Oh, okay. Sorry, can you yeah. please put okay in the screen? Tell I me. have a little question because I don't know. Tell me. Uh, in the first, uh, the, the word book is a, a word that sounds similar or not? Or... Book. Uh, here you can fully pronounce the K because there is no another word after, oh, okay. after the, the word book. Okay, okay. So you can perfectly say book. Okay, it's only when we, you, when we need to say two words. Right. Yes, look, uh, notice that when T, D, K, G, P, and B are followed by other consonant sound. Okay. In that case, they are unreleased. Unreleased means that they are stopped, contained. Okay, you don't pronounce the, the letter with the full sound. Okay. That's it. So you don't say yes, but can you take it back to Greg tomorrow? No, right? So you stop the sound. Yes, but can you? Yes, but can you take it back? Take it back. Mm -hmm. Back to Greg tomorrow. So you are stopping those consonant sounds. Okay. Okay, thank you. Any other question, people? The same with this word here, rest. Because it's the last word, you can pronounce it to the fully potential, rest. 
this one, okay? That one is Okay, not. thank you. You can release the sound. Okay, people, let's stop here tonight. Enjoy your your day off tomorrow. Okay, teacher. And yeah. so do you. Okay, be careful if you are. Nice weekend and Salvador. enjoy. Okay. Good night. Bye bye, okay. people. Have a good night, everyone. Good night, people. Nice Blessings. Weekend. See you on Monday. See you on Monday. All right. Bye bye.